Hello, everyone. We meet again. I, the eldest cousin of Hong Yang Machinery. Ah, my name is Davis. Today, I will take you to learn about our bridge cutting machine. Lai, sang sanpin. Four plus one bridge cutting machine. Its main function is first cross cut longitudinal cut. That's what we call straight cutting. Second, it's a 45 degree cut. Third, his milling cutter can rotate to 90 degrees. Use a milling cutter to open our basin holes. In addition to that, it can also cut a round table oval, uh, doing all kinds of special shape processing because our machine supports CAD to import graphics to realize the countertop processing of our stone. Let me show you the system used by our adjustment machine. Come on, we can now import our CAD graphics. It can also guide other graphics. Of course, you can also draw any graphics you want. Just import it into our operating system through CAD. This is the area for one of our pumps. What's the primary purpose? It is used in our work platform. As you can see, our work platform is flipping from 0 degrees to 80 degrees. I just showed you our turnaround. A display from 0 to 80 degrees. Then it has another function. It is our lifting platform that can be raised. Okay, you can see this. When processing our slate, it's very helpful. It can help us adjust the knife to the lines. Just now we said absolute value. It has memory. And then the benefit of it is that it is comparable to the non-absolute version of the 4-volt motor. Its cutting efficiency is 30% faster. What about our housewarming? There is another property as well. I'll take everyone to find out. What we use inside is an oil immerse structure. You can go we can store our lubricating oil in it. You only need to add it once a year. And we have another little detail here for you to look at. So here is a spring. The main function of this spring is to pull. Our whole knife head is very heavy. We react to the knife head with a spring. Then it can go up and down very easily. Reduce one friction of our linear guides. Therefore, the lifespan of the machine is greatly improved. So here comes our last big show. Here, this is a uh, water-cooled motor. As you can see, we just cut these sheets in succession. It took about two hours. What about our entire motor? It doesn't actually heat up. The biggest reason is because of our water cooling cycle. Therefore, the working efficiency and stability of its motor, as well as its continuous working ability, are very strong. We've cut it. Let's take a look at the results. This is a newly processed countertop. This wash basin. Curved inner hole. Hole. Cut the faucet hole. We do it all at once. Come, let's take a look. It's been cut. Good one. Good one. That's a 45 degree bevel. Six sides. You can see the hexagonal warrior. Oh, come on. Let's take a close up of our camera.
Okay, we made an L-shaped one, a machining process. Let's take a look at this L-shaped one. This one shade corner position, you can do it independently with a milling cutter. Come on, let's take a close up of the camera. Up there. We just cut another big circle. Let me show you the effect of cutting out as you can see. This circle is cut out very beautifully. Okay, let's get a close up of our camera as well. Okay, what about our issue? The key point is to show you a display of the function and process of our four plus one bridge cutting machine. Old Ty, who was so interested. Welcome to Tell Me in the Common Area. Hong Yu, Machini's eldest cousin, will take you to learn more about bridge cutting machines. Then we will see you again in this issue.